Hello kids! In the previous video, we learned to add and subtract money with some interesting examples. In this video, we will look at some common mistakes related to it. Raju and Bablu have come to Gaggu's shop to buy notebooks, pencils and some other items. Raju asked Gaggu for one notebook, one rubber and one pencil. Gaggu added the value of all three items in this way. Children, tell me if Gaggu's addition is correct. No, Gaggu has done the addition wrong. Kids, can you tell what mistake has Gaggu made? Let's find this out by putting this addition together. What shall we do first? We'll add the numbers of paise. How much money do we get by adding 50 and 50 paise? 100 paise. How do we write this? Yes, we will write 100 paise as carryover in this way. See kids, Gaggu added 100 paise correctly. But he forgot to write the carryover made from it. Now can you tell by adding rupees how much Raju actually has to pay for the goods to Gaggu? If you want, you can pause the video and find the answer. Well done kids, you have found the right answer. Raju owes Gaggu 23 rupees for those items. Just like you, Raju too caught Gaggu's mistake and gave him 23 rupees. Now Bablu asked for one pencil box from Gaggu and gave a 50 rupee note to Gaggu. In this way, Gaggu deducted 22 rupees 50 paise of the pencil box from rupees 50 and returned 28 rupees 50 paise. Children, has Gaggu returned the right amount to Bablu? Let's see. First, we will subtract the numbers written in paise. Oh no! Can we deduct 50 paise out of 0 paise? No. So, what shall we do now? All right. Now, we will use the borrowing process. We will borrow 1 rupee out of 50 rupees. And in this way, we will write it as 100 paise. And since we have borrowed 1 rupee, what do we have to do? Yes, we have to cut 50 rupees and write 49 rupees. Now, out of 100 paise, how much money is left after deducting 50 paise? 50 paise. Children, if we look at the subtraction done by Gaggu, we will find that Gaggu also used the borrowing process like us. But he forgot to cut 50 rupees and write 49 rupees. Therefore, the amount returned by Gaggu to Bablu was wrong. Children, can you find the right amount by subtracting the numbers written in rupees? Well done, children. You have written the correct answer. Gaggu was to return 27 rupees 50 paise to Bablu. Bablu too quickly did the math like us and found out that Gaggu gave him 1 rupee more. He promptly returned 1 rupee to Gaggu. Gaggu was happy to see the honesty of those children and gave them one one pencil for free.
In this video, we saw some common mistakes related to adding and subtracting money.